The York County Sheriff's Office facing a lawsuit. Dude. Attorneys for Trevor Mullinex say deputies were negligent and malicious in how they handled an interaction with him in 2021. Almost 50 shots, including to the back of somebody's head. That person's not a threat. They say Mullinex was considering suicide when law enforcement was called to help. Attorneys say his mother, Tammy Beeson, was standing by the car consoling him when officers opened fire, shooting Mullinex nine times. He survived. So all we wanted was to get some help for my son. Never in my life have I ever, ever imagined that I would be put in danger by someone on the law enforcement. In dispatch audio and body camera footage shared by Mullinex's attorneys, you can hear investigators ask about warrants he had before the shots rang out. Your PD was looking for Trevor Mullinex last night. And they're saying it's burglary first and malicious injury. Video shows when they arrive to the scene, officers tell someone at the home. He's got to go to jail. But attorneys say those charges were later dropped. They took the, oh, he's got warrants and overlooked the fact that this was initially was a welfare check from his cousin that said, we're just trying to get some help from our buddy. In a statement to WCNC Charlotte, the sheriff's office stood by their actions, saying in part, quote, Mr. Mullinex chose to put these men in danger by pulling a shotgun. These deputies responded appropriately to the threat as they were trained to do. Had Mr. Mullinex made different choices that day, deputies would not have been required to use force. But attorneys say Mullinex planned to use the gun on himself and only wanted support. With Mullinex adding, he hopes the suit helps others facing emotional challenges. If it helps even one single person in this world to not have to go through what me and my family have, I'm okay with it.